everyone. Welcome to a new episode of Crypto Tips. Today, I have a very special guest, guest with me, Ernest from Decrypted.tax. Thank you, Ernest, for joining us today. Good to be here. So today we got a ton of questions from our Patreon members. Actually, if you guys want to check out our group, it's uh, patreon.com slash crypto tips. And our members are sent in a ton of questions for Ernest today to talk about tax preparations, what to expect if you are a U.S. citizen dealing with the IRS and your cryptocurrency investments. So we got a ton of topics to go through. So let's get to it. Also, I, but before I forget, you mentioned something about how paying the interest on a loan from crypto, if you're, if you're borrowing crypto and you're paying interest on it, that's taxable, that's a tax deduction. Some people are trying to basically liquidate their crypto without uh, paying a tax on it. And so borrowing cryptocurrencies was a way to do that because you're actually putting up oftentimes 100% collateral. And then the crypto that you receive to be able to spend, um, is that a taxable event? It, what happens, and, and we hear a lot about billionaires who don't pay any taxes because all of their they, they don't have any income and they always borrow against their assets. Mm -hmm. And that's that's how they get away with it. And borrowing against your crypto is the best way to to avoid US federal income tax on the assets that you're receiving because you own crypto. That is very good tax planning to borrow against your crypto rather than sell your crypto and generate tax there. Yeah, probably it's best to do so as we're entering a bull run, not maybe as the <laughs> <laughs> pair market is coming in, just so then you know you don't have to keep adding to your position for that collateral, but uh, interesting. So definitely some things to pay attention to for anyone who's trying to tax plan and, and be as proactive as they can.